Fisher's Barbecue in Macon has been in business for a long time, and that's because it's popular. Oh yeah, I found out why it's so great, and I have your health inspection scores in this week's Restaurant Report Card. Hey guys, here at Fincher's Barbecue on Gray Highway in Macon. I've been talking to some of the guys here eating. They think it's fantastic. Some of the best barbecue here in Macon. I cannot wait to try it. Plus, they have a perfect health inspection. I'm Sean Franklin, and this is Restaurant Report Card. Okay, what's your order, sir? They take orders like crazy at Fincher's Barbecue. Chicken tender plate. That's because the barbecue is time tested. Use the same recipes that we've used for 80 years now, and it's it's standard to test of time, and it's always been good. We'll try some here in a second, but first, here's a restaurant that needs to step it up this week. Ichiban Hibachi Buffet on Sam Nunn Boulevard scored a 76. They had raw eggs stored over the vegetables. Some food was stored but not covered, and there were food splatters on the walls in the kitchen. Other scores this week, Acapulco Grill on Hartley Bridge Road, 100. Carmela Joe's on Hemlock Street, 96. Chick-fil-A on Pine Street, 90. Fish House 2 on Napier Avenue, 96. Hong Kong Garden on Hartley Bridge Road, 94. Joy's Home Cooking on Riverside Drive, 93. Bacata Japanese Steakhouse on Riverside Drive, 100. Ribbons Cafe on First Street, 100. Texas Roadhouse on Riverside Drive, 93. The Corner Cafe on Hemlock Street, 88. Good scores this week. Okay. Slow, stew, and fries, on sweet tea. Sounds good already, doesn't it? It's a combination of everything. Having a good staff, having good food, good service. It's, you know, there are so many things that you can do, and, you know, we, we try to do them all. That's what makes Fincher's special. A little bit of everything and a whole lot of barbecue. I love my employees, you know, and they're, you know, we're all family. We spend as much time together as you spend with your family, so you surround yourself with good folks and uh, you end up with uh, good results. Well, it's a beautiful day here in February. You don't get too many good days to eat outside during the winter. I'm looking forward to this. We've got our barbecue plate today. We've got the baked beans, or sorry, the baked beans are over here. We've got the Brunswick stew over here, both really, really good. Can't wait to take a bite of this sandwich. I bet it's going to be pretty good. Mmm. That's good. Plus, Finchers is ordering up a 100 on their health inspection score. You can bring your wife, kids. You can always be sure that it's going to be safe food to eat, and there's no worries. I have a, a barbecue plate, a uh, slaw stew and fries for here. Finchers Barbecue's making the grade this week. Until next week, I'm Sean Franklin, and this has been 41 NBC's Restaurant Report Card. I do enjoy Finchers. Uh, you know, Finchers is great. Um, I've had them catered a couple times as well, doing different events, and uh, really just a good, a good pork sandwich. They're really, really good. That's right. You can't. I mean, no reason to mess it up. When you have something good, don't mess yeah, it up. Yeah, don't mess it up. <laughs> Eighty years, right? Exactly. <laughs> well, you get all of your health inspection scores on our website, 41nbc.com. All right.